I like that. A former team member chose to save raw image data in a table. We remove the table column. Should we shrink the database or leave the data file sizes as they are? You always say that shrinking is bad. So for me, just for me, the question is what percentage of the database is now empty? Then how large is the database? Those would be the two questions I would ask. And, and there's no clear black and white answer. It's not like I have thresholds somewhere. But if you told me that 90% of the database was empty and it was a one terabyte database, then I'm probably concerned because it's going to be easier to restore a 100 gigabyte database than it is to restore a one terabyte database. If you tell me that the database is 50% empty and it's 250 gigabytes, I don't know that I really care that much. I mean, it's just not really that big of an issue for me. Now, but so if you do find yourself in a position where you go, oh my God, it is 90% empty and the file is huge, like it's one terabyte, well, yeah, it's a bigger problem. But the other problem is shrinking 900 gigs out of a one terabyte file sucks so bad. It's so terribly awful. Uh, and take such a long time that the worse this situation gets, the more likely you are going to be to build a new set of data files. Whenever the data, database is growing to a significant size, that's usually when I also want to break the files out or a file group in with four files in it so that I can evenly distribute some of the workload involved against storage, against tuning storage, things like that. Um, so then you create a new file group, put four empty files in it, and you start moving the objects over to the new file group and file. And that can end up being faster because it can be multi-threaded, uh, can be online with Enterprise Edition as well. Um, I'm not saying that it's easy, but it can be less customer impacting than trying to shrink a big ginormous database. So to recap, I'm not worried about it in most uh, concern most places because the relative size of savings isn't small and nobody's really going to notice it. But in uh, cases where it really matters, shrinking probably isn't the answer anyway. You're going to be migrating over to new files.